bit too soon. Oh my gosh! It's not to following me, right? Right? Nah, I think you're in the clear, Slim. Hey, nice work. Thank you. Sincerely. I hardly believe that I deserve to be here at all anymore. I do know what I need to do to make up for my crimes, though. I'm gonna return to the underneath. Try to help all the people I left behind. Fix all the lives I... ruined. And I'm gonna try and find Zara. See if I can't make things right between us. I mean, it doesn't make up for what I... Or what I did to Fred. But if I can heal things with Zara, well, it's something at least. And, and no more admin powers. Everything I do now will just be the normal way. Hope I can still remember how the normal way even works. That sounds fine, Romeo. But it's only the start. You have a lot of making up to do. I know. It's true. Save the world again, huh? Doesn't that ever get old? Why, yes, thank you for noticing. Thought we'd fit in a light bit of world saving before afternoon pie time. Happy to see you all in one piece, too. Whoa, 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 whoa! Is that the admin? Is he- Don't worry. He's not the admin anymore. This is Romeo. Well, that's a relief. No more admins for me, thank you very much. I agree with that 112%, Blondie. But Jesse, after everything he did, do you... Do you really think he deserves to go free? What if he hurts more people? He might... He might have been better off where he was. He doesn't have his admin powers anymore. Now, he's just Romeo. He's harmless. Yeah, I'd worry more about people wanting to hurt him. A lot of people out there who might want a piece of the old admin. What do you guys say we head home? I say, way ahead of you, friend. <laughs> Me too. Man, I cannot wait to put on a shirt again. Jesse! I am approaching you from this direction, and am coming to speak with you. No ninja trickery, hijinks, or tomfoolery here. Both my actions and my intentions are crystal clear. Yeah, I mean... I mean, you're right there. I can see you. I know, I know, but I'm trying not to sneak up on people anymore. So, no more... Ninja Ivor, then? Ha! Huh. No, no. I decided it was time to stop running around in my pajamas and start trying to fix a few messes. Starting with trying to heal the rift between my old friends. Magnus is easy. We'll just pop by Boomtown. Last I heard, Gabriel was doing the wandering warrior thing. Soren? No idea where he is, but I've got some leads. Oh, man, that's awesome. They're gonna be so excited. You think so? That's certainly the way I'm hoping it will happen. Well, I suppose it's time for me to go. This has been fun, though, hasn't it? Jesse! Jesse, hey! What's up, Radar? I was just saying goodbye to... 
Guess ninja habits die hard. I, uh, hope you don't mind, but, uh, I've kind of been taking charge of the beautification project. I thought, why not at least make it look intentional? Really stepping it up to leader mode, if I do say so myself. And it's been stressful, but also fun. So, like, fun, stressful, stress fun? Anyway, I think I've been doing a pretty good job. You've definitely been stepping it up. I'm really proud of you. Oh, wow. This is best day. Whoa! Oh, hey, Luna. Anyway, uh, so with Champion City gone, I was going to make Luna a new llama house and get her set up here in Beacon Town while I help out up there. But, uh, before I did, I thought I'd uh, double-check and see if you'd already been planning on, you know, uh, watching out for her. Seeing, you know, that she likes you so much and all. If you've already built her a llama house when I haven't been around, I, I just wouldn't want to double up. Which, by the way, I'd be okay with you doing if you'd already built one. Or were planning to. I just want to be sure. If she wants to stick with me, it'd be my honor to keep taking care of her. I think she'll really like that. I may not have appreciated you before, but I'm coming around. I'm excited for us to spend more quality time together. Okay. Well, the <laughs> stupid emotions. I do want to sincerely thank you, Jesse, for everything. You saw me at my worst, and you still thought I was worth saving. That, well, that makes me want to try to be better at being my best. Hoping I can start by helping clean up this dump. Dump, uh, <clears throat> you know, poor town. <laughs> what can I say? I looked below the surface and saw that you probably weren't the worst all the way down. What was that about Stella being the worst? <sighs> hey, I was just telling Stella here I would take care of Luna for her. Oh, cool. Well, she seems very excited. Yes, and now I must go. Thank you again for everything. Sincerely. Now, you got everything you need, all packed and double-checked? Yes, Jack. This is very, I don't know, bittersweet for me, you know. Um, goodbyes are no good. Hey. Hmm. That we have, Nermi. So, I won't say it this time. <laughs> Not to people that I will see again. <laughs> you got it. Come on, walk me to the gate. So, you're leaving, apparently? For how long? Honestly, probably a while. But, it's good this time. I'm doing it for me. I'm trying to, like, grow, or whatever. Anyway, I'm about to say goodbye to everyone, and I- ah! Come here. I promised myself I wouldn't cry. Promise oh, broken. Oh, jeez. It'll be okay. So Petra's heading off into the Great Unknown, huh? <laughs> I figured. Definitely sounds exciting. Could start a new town, find temples or dungeons or... whatever you hack and slash types do. Everyone's gotta find their happy place. For Petra, it's mostly in unexplored forests and caves. Yeah. I think I'm closing that chapter of my life for a while. It's time to settle down. Here. Hey, you guys are missing out on prime group hug action. Ah! No air! Actually dying! Ah. <sighs> you don't think this is like the last time we'll all be together, do you? No. Well, maybe. I don't know. I mean, if Petra's leaving... No, hang on. Let's not put all the pressure on me here. Maybe I'll go on an adventure, too. You totally could, man. There's nothing stopping you. Nah, I've got a feeling we'll all be together again. Don't know when, don't know where, but it'll happen. I hope so. <laughs> that sounds nice. 
<laughs> okay. Well, I'm gonna get out of here before I... <laughs> too late. Bye, guys. Be safe out there, okay? The safest. And when you finish that book of yours, I better have a great part in it. Uh-huh. <laughs> Back in the admin's cabin, I, I know you promised that we'd always stick together. But the invite's still open if you want it. No pressure. Wait. You're leaving? Yeah. I think Petra and I are gonna hit the road for a while. Huh. Sounds pretty awesome, right? Yeah. Yeah, I mean, I mean it does, but but without you here, who will run Beacon Town? Things are peaceful now, but danger could still strike at any time. The, the people could uh, they could revolt or something. Who do you think, pal? You. Me? Really? Yeah. I hereby promote you from intern to hero in residence. Thanks, boss. This, uh, you have been, you are. What I'm trying to say is that I promise I'll make you proud. You already have. Everyone's going to miss you, you know? And I'm going to miss them, too. But if anyone ever really needs me, I'll be around. Come on, Luna. Bye, everyone. Hey, dummy! You gonna wait up or what? I was kinda hoping you'd be interested in a race. Ha! You're on! 